Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor, and today we're going to be looking at the free Metroidvania character controller, which will give you a quick start in any 2D game that you want to make, whether this is for prototyping, whether you want a base for a character, or whether you want something to just get you started without needing to do a single line of code yourself. This controller comes with full sound effects, but we'll make sure it's muted so you don't get your ears, and we've got a full character that will run around. There's AI that will run after other AI, the stun will attack you. You have a sword attack which will attack some vegetation, you can attack characters in the world. And you can also jump and be able to wall jump and do different things like sliding down as well. And you have the basic controls just added here to attack, jump and move with the arrow keys. You can set your own inputs if you like, so be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 175 different scripts assets and projects and be sure to check out all the links in the description for all the best sales savings and everything for cross unity and game dev so you can navigate to the unity asset store and it's the metroidvania controller by Iesukaze studio so all you need to do is click open in unity and then once you're there you can go window package manager and once we get to the package manager we can click the drop down and make sure we choose my assets and then you can just type in the metroidvania or just type in Metro and you will get it. And then you can download and install it into your project. So to get to this, you can navigate to the demo scene in the scenes folder. And I've actually just decorated this a little bit nicer, but it was a little bit messy beforehand. The thing is it has a main camera, which follows around your character. It has the draw character, which has all the attack movement and behaviors. We've got some ally AI, which will actually just attack other AI if you placed it around. And it's got an enemy target option. So if you add one of the enemies into the slot there, it will go and actually run along and attack it. As you can see here with the two enemies, then you've got a basic enemy sample, which is the enemy script, which will come and attack you. And then we've got different things, which is a kill zone, some grass platforms, towers, and otherwise these can all be found in the prefabs folder. So you can see that there's enemies so that there's the enemy and the ally. You've got the different environments, so if you need to, or if you want to add more grass, specifically some rocks to your scene, you can do that by just dragging those out. You've got some particles for cutting leaves because they spawn when that happens. You've got the prefabs for projectiles that you can shoot, and you've got the draw character and the main camera. And if you do want to set this up in your own scene, all your scene does need is the main camera from the prefabs, and the draw character from the prefabs too, which will to make the character controller work. On your main camera, you need to make sure that the target on the camera follow is the draw character. And on the draw character attack script on the player, you'll need to make sure that cam is actually the main camera that we added from the prefabs. And you can make sure that that camera is just directly in the center wherever you want it to be initially, and it will follow the player around. And the character controller does come with customizations for the jump force, to be able to control it in the air for different ground checks, which use two different methods to check with the colliders that are on a specific place, the dash force, how much health you have, whether you're invincibles, particles for each of the actions that are performed and different events, attacks and lots of customization. And when you do select on this character and you go to window animation and the animator, you see that it's got the animation state machine to be able to control what animations that it does you so you can swap these out change the sprites and do whatever you want so it's a great start to get you going it does come with a pdf to show you that simple setup that i just mentioned so be sure to check out all the links in the description for all the fantastic savings that you can make for this month check out my patreon to get access to over 175 different scripts assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else and do be sure to come and check out my assets on the Unity Asset Store and also massive savings on my website. Big thanks to all my patrons, including Peter Steiner, Raheem Whitaker, Manos Berakas, Walter Dunson, Rennie Leisure, Alyssa Faden, Daniel Ketashank, Ishikawa Takuya, Hush, Thomas Mersaleski, Callum Murray, Mark Rondu, Marvin Church, Hoagland Naigoyan, Curry for Life Gaming, Sungji Park, Brandon Mannion, Austin Certain, Jean Wine Quaint, Duran Cooper, James McCarthy, Johanna Lixon, Leslie Winter, Heather Fletcher, Mark Vacon, Jose Herrera, Andre Ferreira, Lorientu, Dylan C, Pablo, Liam Gray, Eric Young, Warblin Lynn, Dennis Foreman, Lemu, and Shane Finley. And a big thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. 
Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.